Welcome back to the channel, everybody. In today's video, we have our last entry into the Tamiya TT02 Speed Run Challenge hosted by Poor Boys RC. And in case you're wondering what's with these WL toy wheels on the back of it, well, stick around. You'll see why in a minute. And the results were uh, something. The reason this is my last entry into this year's challenge is because my car has taken a pretty huge beating, which is to be expected when you're trying to go 70 miles per hour on the stock wheels and suspension. The stock wheels on this car aren't bad, up to about 40 miles per hour, but anything more than that, they just are completely unstable. You really need to be having foams to be going really fast. And in this video, we actually attempt to run the car rear wheel drive since I still haven't replaced the front drive shafts. And you'll see in a little while, a uh, very easy, fun, and effective way to completely strip your spur gear. And this week's entry is faster than last week's entry. Not by much, but it's still a little bit faster. So what I'm gonna go ahead and do, since this is my last entry into the challenge, I'm gonna actually post a run that you guys have already seen, which is the 64 mile per hour run where I wiped out horribly. I'm gonna post that run in its entirety from start to finish, and that's gonna be my final entry into the challenge. But before that, let me show you guys my rear wheel drive attempts on this car and how I destroyed the spur gear. Maybe we'll keep the car in one piece this time. Oh my God, okay, well that was fast. I hope I only find the GPS and not a snake. Ah, there it is, oh my goodness. Lucky day. And we got 47 miles per hour, about half the throttle. So I say, since we haven't broke up the car yet, let's go until we break the car. Oh no. By the way, this is the toughest GPS in the wor history of the world. Mullane GPS, I do have a GNSS analyzer, but I'm not gonna come bust up my analyzer with this car. Um, I'll leave that up to my drag car. But this thing I've had for over a year, 47 flat still. And this thing has been through an absolute, absolute beating. So yeah, if you want a very tough, very cheap GPS, you want a Mullane GPS. They're so cheap, you don't really care about them. And they're so tough that you can't really hurt them. Fix my mirror for good luck here. Having your mirrors crooked is bad luck, I think. No, actually having me driving the RC car is bad luck. What am I talking about? Whoa, we almost hit ourselves with that one. <laughs> wow. Well, I did just about nick half throttle that time. 46.9 miles an hour. And we're gonna give this one more try. Uh-oh. I thought I saw something fly off the car and then it spun out. I wonder if it was part of the tire just blowing off. Now you guys understand why my channel's called Wreck RC. I don't do it on purpose. I just have no patience. But what I lack in patience, I also make up for by having also no skills. Oh, yep, tire came unglued, that's why. I guess we'll be switching to the other set of tires now. That feels actually kind of good. Oh, nope, 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 curb, oh. <laughs> oh, oh, I heard it smack the front of my car. Uh, all right, this isn't going well, is it? Uh, these tires are just not good for this, so let's just do some donuts. Woo! Guys, that's resting my finger on the throttle. But you wanna see what full throttle looks like? I do, I haven't seen it yet with this car. I'm just gonna pull the trigger and just see what happens. Full throttle. Let's do it again just for fun. Full throttle. Oh. oh no, I got an idea. Dirt tires, way too much RPMs. Should be cool though. Oh man, look at that. that I'm, I'm in a quarter throttle, let's go full. Oh. Uh-oh, listen to this. We stripped our brand new spur gear. <laughs> but it was worth it, it was fun. Okay, so there is how I destroyed the spur gear. Now, let's see the 64 mile per hour run that I'm gonna be ending this year's challenge with in its entirety. Listen closely for me to choke on a bug, and that's one of the reasons why I didn't post it in its entirety the first time. Let's roll it. Car on. All right, reset the GPS. All right, let's give this thing one more go. Wow, I can't, but remarkably, the car still sounds perfect. Well, trim's a little out of whack, though. 
now the trim's in whack. I think that's far enough. Oh my god! Oh my god! I couldn't steer quick enough, guys! Oh my god! I don't believe this is happening again! Am I the worst RC driver in the entire world? Or just the United States or Northern Hemisphere? Truth be told, you can't really steer this thing at those high speeds with the stock suspension. <clears throat> Truth be told, you can't really steer this thing at those high speeds with that stock suspension and stock wheels. And it'd be hard to steer a car of that wheelbase at those speeds no matter what. Oh, found the GPS straight away this time. Where did we die at? Oh, 64.1 miles per hour. I knew the I knew that last run was over 60 as well, but the GPS hadn't been reset from its previous run. Oh, I did knock the ESC a bit loose. But if that's the only issue, I think I'm a happy guy. Oh no, that's not the only issue. Well, that's gonna do it for this year's challenge for me guys, but poor boys RC, thank you so much for putting the challenge on. It really was awesome. I discovered so many YouTube channels in the RC world that I had no idea that existed and I've subscribed to many of them. So it was a really great way to discover a lot of really cool channels out there. So that's awesome. And poor boys is awesome for putting the challenge on and I will be back next year with a better equipped car, I guess. I guess, I don't, well, I don't know if the car is yet. But whatever it is, I'm going to be running foams next year, for sure. But until then, let me just say, as always, thank you so much for watching. Please like, comment, subscribe. Remember, it's not about miles per hour. It's about smiles per mile. So have fun, and we will see you in the next one. Wait, no, no, no. It's on this side. I got this wrong in the last video. Right here.